Welcome back. The physicist Professor Stephen Hawking says that modern science has established there was no need for God in the creation of the universe. In a new book, Hawking suggests that a theoretical framework known as M-theory can explain how the Big Bang was an inevitable consequence of the laws of physics. Our science correspondent Tom Clark has been grappling with his thinking. He's been fated by world leaders. He's shed new light on black holes. As a popularizer of science, he took the mind-bending field of cosmology to the masses. He's even experienced weightlessness. Now Stephen Hawking has taken on God. Until now, there's been plenty of room for the hand of God. Even though Darwin has explained how life evolved, physicists are yet to unravel the rules of the universe and how it came to be. Einstein's theory of relativity is very good at explaining the big stuff, what forces govern the planets, the stars and the galaxies that fill our universe. People like Erwin Schrödinger and his famous cat helped to refine quantum theory. It explains the weirdness of very small things, subatomic particles like electrons and quarks and the forces that move them around. But the major headache for physics is that quantum theory and relativism don't add up. They can't tell us what came before the Big Bang or why it happened, leaving lots of room for God. But could string theory be about to fill that gap? The basic idea of string theory is that the fundamental constituents of matter are very, very tiny, small pieces of string. And the different vibrations of these uh, bits of string would correspond to different elementary particles. So if the string vibrates in one way, it would be an electron. If it vibrates in another way, it would be a proton. Another way, it might be, correspond to gravity. Um, uh, so in this way, a string, a string theory and these pieces of string would unify all of the elementary particles that we observe into a single theoretical framework. What Stephen Hawking argues in his new book is that the latest advance in string theory called M-theory could soon have the universe all sewn up. It turns out there's five different string theories, uh, but through a lot of hard work that was carried out in the 90s, largely by the UK string theory community, it was realized that these five different string theories are actually ma manifestations or facets of a deeper, richer underlying structure called M-theory. And it's now believed that this idea of M-theory is the most promising route for unification of all of theoretical physics. According to Hawking, by explaining how the universe works in intimate detail, M-theory will mean there's no room left for a creator. That's Hawking's opinion, but does the science back him up? Even proponents of M-theory know it needs validating. Machines like the new Large Hadron Collider could reveal some of M-theory's weirder predictions. But can they prove it? Certainly.